The history of leadership research has focused primarily on the leader. Um, in Western societies, in the United States, in much of Europe, the, um, the focus of leadership studies has been primarily on the leader and seeing the leader as uh, the cause of moving the group or the collective to action. But more recently in leadership studies is a focus on the follower because we know that leadership really is not done by the leader, that leadership is co-created by leaders and followers working together. So followership is a new topic that's emerging in the study of the leader-follower relationship. And one of the things that we know is that followers play an important part, not just in executing the goals of the group or the collective, but followers can play a big part in terms of assisting the leader in the leadership, or what we call co-creating leadership. But followers also play an important part in keeping the leader's behavior in line. Um, particularly when the leader is headed down the wrong path. It's the role of the followers to check the leader and to, um, to be sort of a reality check and help the leader to get back on the right path. Um, so one of the famous books on followership says that the follower's role is to uh, have the courage to not just stand up and support the leader, when the leader is uh, moving in a particular direction. But if the leader is moving in the wrong direction, then it's very important that the followers stand up to the leader. So standing up for our leaders, but also standing up to our leaders when we need to.